The Zoo Star was a champion three-year-old sprinter in Australia. Uh, we bought into him after he won the Coolmore at uh, Flemington on our Melbourne Cup weekend. He was a, just an outstanding athlete, uh, one of Chris Waller's best ever horses, uh, certainly best three-year-old sprinter. Uh, the great thing is he looks like he's <coughs> carrying on at stud like he was on the race course. And he's made an incredible start to his stallion career in Australia. What are some of his biggest achievements to date? Well, he's, he's done something quite extraordinary. He's broken the prize money record for a first season sire in Australasia. He's sired uh, the best three um, three-year-old sprinters in Australia uh, who finished first, second and third in the Coolmore Stakes, the same race that he won. And the same race, funnily enough, that Northern Meter, his sire, and in Costa del Lago, his grandsire won. Uh, one, of the, one of the preeminent sort of uh, stallion making races in Australia. So he's really hit, hit the ground running um, and he's done something that, that no other stallion has done before him. And what does he offer to European breeders? Well, a source of speed that we've not that we've not seen here before, and uh, a perfect outcross for for 99.9% for .9 of the mares in the northern hemisphere. He's going to give people also the opportunity to use a proven Group One stallion at a sort of first season sire price. So uh, it's an outstanding opportunity for nor for northern hemisphere breeders. We're extremely confident he will replicate his Australian success up here. Uh, we've also had the benefit of learning from what sort of mare suits him best and uh, we've certainly been encouraging that speed mile type of mare to come to him. So uh, yeah, he's been going to be given a, a, a very, very strong chance of replicating his Southern Hemisphere success here. And obviously he's in high demand in Australia now. Is this trip to Tween Hills a one-off? Will he be back in the future? So he covered 240 odd mares in Australia last year. We're limiting him here to 125. Um, he will be back. Uh, the deal when we bought into him was that he would come and stand at Tween Hills in the Northern Hemisphere time. And we decided not to do that until he was a proven stallion. Now that he's proven, he will keep coming back to Tween Hills and keep um, representing this outstanding opportunity for, for European breeders.